bags these days are calling for vinyl type fabric, vinyl or even the clear vinyl you can see through, which is just fine to sew on except that the metal foot tends to stick to the vinyl and the stitches are not even. So this is why you have these little glide soles. Um, they're actually stickers that are in with your accessories and you can peel these off and put them on the underneath side of your feet and that will make things slide or glide. Um, they almost have a, um, it's a slippery coating here. Uh, Teflon, that's what I'm trying to say. It's kind of like a Teflon feel here. Now this will work great because you can put it on a zipper foot if you're putting a zipper in and you're it was sticking to the vinyl. Uh, leather would be another fabric that this sometimes happened. Now if you get into sewing a lot more of this and the stickers aren't keeping up with you, you want to get one of the non-stick glide foot H and then that way it will, it actually has that completely on the underneath side. Here you go. Look. Perfect. And if you look over at your sewing advisor, if you actually set it for leather, you'll see that H is the recommended foot. And that is an option, I believe, I didn't see one in here. So yes, that is an option on this machine. And, but then you can, when you pick like a, a seam, it will make sure your stitch length is long. So not to be too close together and perforate the vinyl. That would be no fun. It also recommends a stretch needle, size 90 would be a great one to use. But then I'll make sure that it picks the right stitches no matter what you're on. Just remember when you're done uh, working with a leather or vinyl that you switch it back to like a B setting so not to be kind of left on that weird um, <laughs> fabric down below here. But that's what these stickers are. Don't throw them out. You never know when you need them and you'll be glad you have them.